Welcome back to another video from Leah Beat Art slash Born Lux, depending on what I want to call myself. Sorry I've been MIA lately, but um, hopefully I'm bringing you something very interesting today. Yay! So I ordered this Jazzer's Jazzy Art Box um, on the second pre-order because I missed out on the first one. Got it about end of November, I think and haven't had a chance to unbox it yet, so I thought I would do that with you guys. Yay! So let's get into it. So first we have his hilarious face. So I might actually cut that out and put it on my wall. Let's, we'll see. Right, let's have a look at what's in the box. So we got this card that says, thank you for getting Jazz's Jazzy Art Box. And then all of the things that he's put in the box. Interesting. We've got a coupon. Probably doesn't work now. <laughs> oh, nice little bookmark with Jazz's face on it. Oh, it's a nice little drawing. Very cute. Okay, now we're into the good stuff. Okay, so we've got fine liner graphics in a number of different thicknesses. So we've got a brush tip, 0 0.2, 0 0.4 and 0 0.8, probably can't see, but they're quite nice. Mm. Come in handy for uh, Right, next is the Faber-Castell Dust-Free Clean and Soft Erasing Eraser. It's quite a nice one. Uh, next we have Faber-Castell 12 Polychromos Colour Pencils. Quite nice. I've never had Polychromos before. I've got the Prismacolor pencils, but I haven't had Faber-Castell Polychromos, so these will be interesting to test out. Next we have a piece of plastic. Whee! So we have 12 piece illustrator by Spectrum Noir. Dual tip brush markers. Hmm. There's Jazz's lovely face on them. Dee 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 dee. They're like hexagonal. Oh wow. Nice. They will be fun to try out. Ooh, look at all the colours you get. Very nice. Didn't open these, did I? I should open them. Because we are opening these together! Shh. Oh, look at the colours! Oh, nice! Oh, we like these, yes we do. Yes, yes. Yummy. I don't think I need to open the eraser. We know what eraser is. Right, Express It Blending Card. Acid Free, Archival, Mark Universal, blah de blah blah. Hmm. I'm guessing it's just paper testers. 
Oh yeah, it's like really smooth, kind of like Bristol smooth, I guess. Yeah. Very nice. <gasps> so we have a Hanmir Nostalgie sketchbook. 190 GSM, 80 pages. Well, this looks like a very nice sketchbook. Let's open it. This is a nice sketchbook. I actually like the cover because it's kind of textured. But um, the only thing I'll say about this is that um, I generally use Spyro sketchbooks because obviously when you want to turn a page, it's like, oh uh, no, it doesn't lay flat unless you break the spine, which I don't like doing on sketchbooks. But um, also got a nice little bookmark doohickey, so that's cool. Yeah, that's nice. What else have we got? We have a Tombow ABT water-based in N15. Oh, Ooh, nice. This looks very nice. It's like a dual, dual tipped pen. Very nice. Should probably be looking at um, this, shouldn't I? Idiot. Right, so what have we had so far? Got the ja the limited Jazza print exclusive artwork. Yep. Twelve pack Jazza edition Spectrum Noir markers. Yep. Twelve pack of Polychromos. Yep. The Home Mule sketchbook. Yep. Who keeps messaging me? Good grief. Uh, oh, okie dokie. Got this. Pencil case. I'm not quite sure why that's come off of it, but um so this is the blah, 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 blah. Global Art Supplies Premium 24 piece canvas pencil case in charcoal. It's a very nice pencil case. Yep. If you want to keep everything flat together, what have you? Normally I just use my uh, my Ruby Gloom pencil case because, you know, goth girl at heart, but yeah, I mean this could come in useful for like more of my more expensive things like my Prismacolor pencils and um, other things that I like to use or like um, the alcohol markers when you don't want to just bung them in a suitcase for a suitcase. Pencil case. Nah. So yeah, that for some reason came off. So four pack of Marabou Graphics Fine Liners. Yep, we got those at the start. Ooh. Zebra M301 Mechanical Pencil in 0.5 mil in black. Or graphite, because you know, it's not really black, is it? Hmm. To be fair, I haven't used um, mechanical pencil in a while because every time I use it, because I'm such a heavy handed drawer that when I use it, I mean, like, it just snaps. Like, I mean, look how thin it is! Anyway, it's a very nice pen. Don't get me wrong. On to the next one. Prismacolor Colorase Blue Pencil. It's a very nice pencil. I've actually been looking for one of these Colorase pencils. Um, but um, until now, I haven't been able to get one. So to get one in this box is very handy. Because I'd love to try it out, because I've been using more pencils, uh, less less than mechanical pencils, I've been using proper pencils to draw with, so that will be interesting. Obviously we've looked at the Tombow Dual Brush Pen in black.
missing one. So that's the Tombow dual brush pen. Where's my Tombow food no soup? Because we had the eraser and we've got the white uniball gel pen here and then the express it that's a bonus item so oh no jazza what's going on i'm missing one sucks yeah I'm missing a pen oh no oh no oh was a very um, sad ending to uh, my unboxing video <laughs> oh dear well apart from the missing pen uh, I hope you've enjoyed this unboxing video hopefully I'll, I'll give I'll, I will send an email although I, as because I haven't opened this uh, since like when I got it I don't know if they're gonna be able to do anything but um, I'll give them an email and see what's happened to my my extra pen because yeah it's not in the box and I'm not quite sure where it is um, yeah but uh, if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and a like hit that subscribe button and uh, hopefully I'll see you in the next one which shouldn't be too long <laughs> see you later guys bye